Nearly half a century after the genocide in Namibia, the Hiroros tribes and Nama are demanding for justice. For long, the murderers has remained ignored, both in Europe and Africa, but the facts not disputed. According to historians, in 1904, about 80,000 Hiroros out of the population of 100 were massacred, deported, and exterminated on order of General Luther von Trotter. To save their lives, many native people fled to neighboring Botswana. Veronica is a descendant of Hiroro survivors. The Germans did suffer my grandmother. She had to flee. She grew up abroad. She was forced to speak another language. We live in poverty because of what they did to us at the time. We want repairs. We want them to dignify our land. Long in denial, Germany has begun to recognize its responsibility. Negotiations are even in the course with the government in order to obtain a formal apology and repairs. I don't expect anything from this negotiation because they are suspect from day one. The way they are crafted, this negotiation says that every Namibian is affected. It is denying the fact that the Namas and Heroes were affected. These negotiations are a flawed from the beginning to the end. The traditional chiefs of Hiroro and Nama have been demanding for months a seat at the table of negotiation between Widhok and Berlin. The two tribes have therefore responded by filing a complaint for genocide against Germany before a court in New York. The Heroros and Namas are not the majority in our government and of course they would want to see uh, uh, the government really, you know, taking that into account, and that is already being taken care of. The Hiroro, whom said a victory far drawn, promised to fight until they get repairs.